Okay, we're getting ready for the head up drop test of our standard single belt egress. This belt's used as uh, all in all our FRED systems, our SCBA systems, our fire belt, um, fire belt press. Uh, it's basically a single belt uh, escape. It's this, yeah, single belt and it's uh, certified as escape. This has already seen the static test of 13.5 kilonewtons, which is 13, so 3,000, 2,900, sorry, 2,900 pounds on one minute off and then on for five minutes. There again, this is Kevlar, so it's going to make a, make a pretty loud bang. Mannequin did not hit the floor, which is a plus. Looking at the stitching from here, stitching looks to be intact. I do not see any tears on the waist belt. We'll take a closer look later. These, these tests are absolutely grueling. And, you know, we put our harnesses through uh, quite a bit with this. Uh, we really shouldn't be using the same belt for all three tests. And if for some reason this should fail, then it's not really a failure. We'll just uh, take a new belt and re we'll redo the two uh, drop tests. Uh, there again, the, the head down is probably the worst, the hardest test to pass. And uh, we'll see if this uh, holds up for all three tests. Static and two dynamic drops. And here we go. Okay. Looks like we did all right there, William. Well, <laughs> we've been here a few times before. <laughs> okay, even with uh, partial tearing of the webbing after the first drop test, uh, we kind of went ahead and took the chance uh, for the head down, which is the harshest test. And uh, obviously there's a little abrasion there. Harness passed wonderfully.